Welcome to the course on Retail Analytics. I am going to be your course instructor, Anshuman Acharya. This course is divided into three modules. The first of these three cover the fundamentals of the retail business. These are the overview module, the retail strategy module and the retail business module. In the overview module, we will begin with an introduction to what retail is and who a retailer is. We would look at the various roles that a retailer plays in our society. Then we will be looking at the physical manifestations of retail in our lives in the forms of channels and formats. Then we will be looking at the types of goods which are sold through retail and a basic classification of these goods. Finally, we would be looking at how retail has evolved through the ages in the current formats that we see today over the years. In the strategy module, we would be looking at how retailers define and identify their target markets. Then we will be looking at how they design the appropriate propositions for these identified markets. And finally, we would be looking at the competitive advantages that a retailer builds to sustain his business against the competition in the long term. In the third module on retail business, we would begin with reading a retail's profit and loss statement. From this profit and loss statement, we would be covering five key retail functions which are real estate, buying, distribution, store design and store operations. These three modules are designed to answer all the fundamental questions of what a retail business is, the who of it, the why, the where and the when and the how. In the overview module, when we look at introducing a retailer, we are essentially identifying who the retailer is. Then looking into the types of goods typically sold in retail, we are answering the question of what the retailer sells. Then channels and formats define where the retailer sells them. The evolution of retail answers why retail today is the way it is and how it has evolved and changed over the years. The next two modules, strategy and business, define the workings of retail by defining how the retail business is designed and operated upon. Hence, after covering these three modules, we would be having a holistic knowledge of the retail business and this knowledge would drive our understanding of the final module which is the retail analytics. Hence, the overall structure and design of the course emphasizes the fact that retail analytics is essentially a solution for the retailer's business and at the end of this course you will be an analytics expert who can speak the retailers language, understand their business concerns and design analytical solutions that would help them make their business more profitable. So I welcome you to this course and look forward to being your guide over the next series of lectures. So let us begin with the first module 
an overview of retail.